guys, it's your boy The Mental Wolf Black reminding you to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and share. And let's get right into today's scheduled programming. Well, I hope scheduled. And hey, 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 what is the Delio Frulio? This is your boy Dimension Wolf Black Bad getting in with another YouTube video. And today we're playing multiverses, but I'm not playing. This is post commentary of me playing. I mean, I'm not playing at the moment, but anyway, we're hopping into these matches. Look at the movement. We are, we are playing against Agarne. I'm playing Steven Universe. I'm having very much fun today. Well, this was where recorded a while ago when I first unlocked Steven. I didn't really know any specific uh, techniques. I was just playing around in the training room and I got like a couple things kind of down from what I've seen on YouTube and stuff like that. So I was just been bada bada bing, bada bada boom. But like, I just I don't have anything really down. Like any like advanced stuff, I just kind of wing it on the fly. And I also need to learn how to uh, do two things that I did in this match more precisely. One, when I get Watermelon Steven out, do neutral special because it actually acts as a TNT or like a, a C4. If you play COD, you can probably, you know, just guess. Uh, the the neutral special is that belly button thing that he did where like, you know, the tether came out of his belly button and like it put like uh, an orb on the screen and that orb actually acts as a detonator. So anywhere between that line, and the detonator and connected to Steven will cause an explosion and it's really good for knockouts, uh, vertical knockouts. And that shield is actually really good for knockouts too. You can travel behind it, very, very good. That up there was very satisfying to land. Um, when it comes to, I'm way back here. You cannot hear me. Um, wow. Like I said earlier, that up air was very uh, satisfying to land, and uh, Steven's up special is actually a very good kill move at like, I'd say halfway up, I'd say halfway up in the air. I don't know how I died just there. Defeat. I just got, uh, yeah, step back to T. I just got fucked over. Oh, and that surf uh, move I was doing, I need, to, I need to learn how to combo off that because you can uh, carry a lot of momentum off that move. Yeah, so I just plain and simple got washed and she did not mean that. And yeah, we're back at it again with the next match. In this match, I believe I am against an Arya Stark, which is a very interesting character. But the most interesting thing about her is her lack of frames every time she boots up in the game online. What the fuck was that? Anyway, this time I'm really trying to just get in on Arya, really incorporating more of the side air cancels right off of the... Uh, right off of the uh you know like uh i mean like the side light cancels as soon as i get back on the ground and i also have like the perk where shields actually do more bounce damage which is great so which is like great for like steven combos because steven can like really clap you up into shield like look at that all that all that block stuff well no I, I think this is before i put the perk on i think it's in later episodes where i put the perk on I'm, I'm, I'm gonna have to look at the raw footage. This is all edited footage. I'm gonna have to look at the raw footage. This perk, I do like about Steven a little bit, but it's kind of hard to kind of like control because they can still control the bubble. So like, oof, it's kind of annoying. But right now, I'm just trying to play neutral here. There, I just kind of use what I said earlier, kind of canceling the momentum of, ooh, fuck, I love getting that kill with that shield. It's kind of like Wonder Woman, but in, rare, but in reverse. Uh, usually with Wonder Woman, you can't get the kill with the shield, but I'm like, from what I've done, it's way more consistent to get the kill with her up air because it hits so weird. And if they even dodge a little bit, you can delay it to get like the tip of part of her up air, which is, which is kind of like bounces her off the ground. But anyway, I land the uh, neutral light with uh, Steven there. Waterman and Steven dies. I land, I land, I land the neutral light with the Steven there, and I'm trying to apply the rose bubble so I can get her higher to the ground as possible when I do that. But now it's just like just playing the game at this point because that strategy did not work. And I'm in mid match. I started to realize, oh, I can utilize this more to kind of act as a win condition. On like on like knockouts and I got fucking stabbed one for And also he has like a Smash Brothers shield. If you play Smash Brothers before, there's like a shield system to where like you can like you know just use it as a shield, you know, block and shit. But you know, since so somebody in the comments will explain that better, you know, the properties of the shield and such, please do, because some people might want to get into Smash and so on and so forth. But this match is actually very intense as me trying to use the shield mechanic more, trying to, you know, bait out some of these hits. Trying to save Watermelon Steven, Steven from, inf from infinite bit. never mind, never, never mind. Got killed by my own shield, Jesus Christ. And yeah, I'm just trying to play, just dead ass, just play neutral here. And another thing about Steven is that when he fires that little uh, yellow side shield off that I keep following behind, which I kind of use as like a uh, kind of follow up projectile, kind of like how I do in Dragon Ball Fighters with like shit, you know. 
just kind of do up a jet tower and like run up behind it. I kind of use it like that. And actually, his neutral is actually really good as well. Oh yeah, that's a really good part of uh, Steven's uh, neutral special is that it can actually act as just like a remote detonator. If they're like anywhere in the blast radius of the line or like either Steven or whatever he's attached to, it's just a giant blast radius and he can get some really good kill combos early. Like really early from what I've seen. I say at like 40% and I died. I got killed with the Psycho Crusher there. But she's at high percent so I don't really even have to try that hard. I'm just doing all this neutral shit because I really don't know what this Arya is capable of like at full. So all oh, dead. Wow, that was fast. Anyway, well, it wasn't necessarily fast. That Aria was putting in a lot of work, but in the end, I came out victorious. That cut in the last clip was kind of abrupt, but I don't know if they'll want to play again. Yeah, they declined. Anyway, I'll see you all in the next match. And yo, guess what's up, what's up, what's up? We're back at it again in the next match, and we are in the back cave up against another Garnet. Like, seriously, online is like just riddled with Garnets nowadays, but this Garnet looks like she knows what she's doing, and I'm glad, because I've been running into spammy Garnets for like the last couple matches in this entire set. This is all pre-recorded, by the way, just to specify. Just to specify, just like I said in the beginning of the video, this is all pre-recorded, so just keeping it a buck. Right now, I'm just trying to get in on this gun. She's really utilizing her buffs and stuff like that. You know, that singing that she's doing there, that can reflect projectiles, I'm pretty sure. Her down is really good. Wow, this gun is actually balling. Okay, then I'm just really trying to find my space in. I'm not really using the shield mechanic as I said I should have. See right there, I think I got it right here. Yep, yes I do. I do have the more blocks done on this one, I'm pretty sure. Oh shit, I almost died. Oh shit, you see the neutral airs? You see the neutral airs? Ugh, I'm kind of following them. I'm kind of on their ass. I'm kind of on their ass. Ugh. Really just playing neutral here. Fuck. Just trying to get the up there. I mean, the uh, up special for the KO misses. The gun is really wilding. Just wilding out of control. Up air again. I mean, up special, down special. Trying to get some heals off. Watermelon Steven gets knocked. Shield blocks him off. Just swinging there for no reason. Watermelon Steven's doing nothing here. Up airing. And I die. Up airs from the gun to go crazy. I mean, uh, up, up neutral attacks from Garnet because that was neutral attack because it was on the ground. I need to get my terminology correct. Oosh. That was a really good uh, new, uh, just raw side special out of me and the up air for the win. I do a little bit of a troll spin there, kind of a mind game, you know what I'm saying? You got to, you got to, you got to, you know, you got to test a, you got to test a uh, stability sometimes, you know what I'm saying? Man, was dead ass just punching my seal like a damn bongo, crazy. One man, oh fuck, I'm dead. I should have went in more with the shield because it would have detonated. Watermelon Steven died, I fired the shield to kind of give myself some spacing. I'm kind of just playing with the shields right now. Damn, combos, combos, combos. That clap is fucking me up here. I'm really just trying to find a, find a way back in, but I, what I really need to do is just play neutral. I don't need to go in all that hard. And I die, oh, did I die here? No, I didn't, I surfed back in. I tried to get a side light off, but I charged it. I almost died here again. And I almost killed myself, actually. She, she, she's getting some singing off. I really don't know what else her singing does for her. Besides uh, reflect projectiles with the... Oh, fuck, yeah. That neutral special. When she launches the garments, it's a really good kill move. No lie. That was a very intense match. I was really just trying to just think of a way to kind of just... Disrupt her game plan, but it was not going. Disrupt their game plan, but it was not going at all. That's all. We're going right back in with the rematch here. Do I go for a character switch? I don't remember. No. Sticking with the Steven. Sticking with the theme of the video. This garnered up against the Wonder Woman map. I do just have the triple jump on. I did not know how to train any perks at this time. So, woof. 
Well, I kind of did, but I just, just never really got around to officially learning it. It's actually way easier than I thought it'd be, so yeah, I really was suffering for no reason. This game is pretty good, no lie. Anyway, best of three. Bop and bop. And I got a neutral like right off the bat. Wonderful. I tried to shield. Nope. Okay, using the blast radius. He got hit with the rose, and now he's rosed up. Now each now if I hit him ten times with that rose counter on him, oh fuck, he cleansed it. I mean it it, it probably wore a wore off. I didn't see cleanse appear above his head, so it probably just wore off. Okay, I get the double claps on it. Pause. I mean, uh, not pause, but you know what I'm saying? They're kind of uh, related. You know what I'm saying? They're teammates. You know what I'm saying? They don't look at each other that way. Oops, oops, oops. Fuck. Get the claps. Get the claps. Get the claps. Get the claps. Wait. I'm, I'm, I'm really just trying to play neutral because uh, Steven's uh, belly button shield is actually very uh, disjointed. So I can really just play neutral with that and just kind of go, get, go in and out. But making it very hard. And that uh, ground move there, I think I can dodge up and out instead of up and in to kind of avoid that, to kind of avoid where she kind of launches that little uh, electrical bubble from her finger. Probably like up and back to probably dodge that, to probably dodge that setup. But then she can still aim it at a like damn near any angle, even straight up. So it's kind of like a whole guess on uh, either side. And Garnet also has a pretty good neutral air as well. Also hitting on all sides, damn near. Bounce right off the shield. I tried to get it with an up with a up special, but that didn't work out. Hits me with another uh, nair. I mean, uh, a neutral a neutral special. I'm pretty sure. I get it with with my neutral special. She's coming back in with hers. I mean, a neutral light. Neutral light into shield, neutral light. I'm kind of just using shield to kind of stall my momentum. She gets me with a nair. Gets her with a side air. Up clap. Comes in with a, with a with a dare. Lag. What the hell? I stop my momentum. Shield. Oh my god. Okay, so that does reflect my projectile in general. So I really have to just play smarter. Even though I'm, all my dives have less. Even oh fuck, she gets the first KO at 335. I'm really just trying to stay alive here, but I have the health advantage, so I should really be playing a little bit more aggressive. But I can still get just garnered to death. And when I shoot that yellow shield, it's kind of on a cooldown, and I kind of have another move called Dash Kick, which is actually a pretty good move to just have out that's active that you can also dash cancel from. Well, well, not really a dash cancel from dodge cancel. Excuse me. I don't really do it as much as I should, but it's just a really good move to just have out, uh, out this active. We are really just try harder right now. Okay, gets. I think I got. No, I. I don't think I got the special radius from that. I mean, that's the special uh, property from that clap KO, but that was a really clean clap KO. And I put the orb there. I don't know how you can aim the orb. I really didn't fucking read those Steven Universe's uh, special moves like that. I kind of just started playing. I'm gonna go through them again soon. Because learning if you could aim that little uh, neutral special is actually very important. And I do figure out that I can float with Steven Universe's uh, up shield, which is actually really good. I, th I think I already said that in the other match, but yeah. Why would he trade when he could just negate the shield altogether? He literally just did it last match. And see, look, see, look, that electronic finger shot is just so good. It just. It's just such a good like uh, space cover, and she has lots of good moves to. Ah, uh, shit! I died. No, I didn't. Oh, see, look, I got a little beauty there, and I died here. Yep. I kind of gave her the match there. I d I, I should have not got gotten greedy there. I should have just uh, set up shop with an up shield, with a, a up special to kind of cover their approach because then they only had just two ways to get up. You know what I'm saying? They either had to go over the up shield or you know, come my way and possibly get fucking combo to death. But anyway, I'll see you guys in the next match. Choose your character. Ready when you are.
And we are back at it again. I'm going to make this the third and final set of uh, out of this footage, which is Steven Universe versus an Iron Giant. This match uh, was kind of pain for the Iron Giant, but I don't remember who won this, so this will be an intriguing treat for me as well. Yeah, I'm trying to go in, trying to abuse the fact that Iron Giant's fucking huge, but that command grab literally hid behind me. I mean, behind him, but okay. I'm really just trying to abuse the fact that he's fucking huge, but yeah, yeah, there we go. Up clap, up clap. Yeah, uh, attack the K. I really don't care because he's fucking huge. Yep, he's bubbled. He's bubbled. Oh damn. Damn, that effect was delayed as hell. Okay, a uh, spike, up, a special, up special, dash kick. This Iron Giant's really going, like, really trying to survive here. I got the rose, I got the pop up. Damn, the Iron Giant got me with the side, with the side light. I'm pretty sure. Side light, side light, Beyblade, let it rip. Okay, I hit it with the shield. Up clap, up special. He's still alive. He does the butt slam. I hit him with the side special. Interrupts. He hits me with the butt slam again. I hit him with a spike. He's bubbled. I'm trying to clap him up, clap him up, pause, clap him up, clap him up, clap him up. He dies. No, not dead yet. Dead off the up clap. Hit him with a little bit of a spit now, you know what I'm saying? Gotta, you know, test their mental sometimes. Oh god. Shield. Nothing happens. I bounce off my own shield. It is a double edged shield sword, by the way. I'm shielding up. I'm shielding up. I did not know. Uh, and by the way, just know that uh, after the first two hits of Steven's shield, you can actually attack immediately afterwards. I did not know that. It means I've been, like, not taking my turn uh, during these sets later on in the later episodes. Probably not the episodes after these, but the episodes probably, like, I don't know, probably a couple down. Right here, I'm just kind of testing the shield, seeing what he can do. Uh, surf. I know it's kind of kind of seen that this is special to kind of to kind of test something mid match, but I'm like, hey, like what else? I, I like you know, I have a stock, you know what I'm saying? There's not that big with you, you know. There's no there's no bag on the line, you know what I'm saying? There's no rank, you feel me? He, he, we all just trying to hone our characters. But anyway, I'm just really trying to KO this Iron Giant here. Oh my God, what a disgusting sequence! It is so unfortunate that his hitbox is that big. It is so unfortunate. I think I dropped a quarter on the ground with Steven. Anyway. <clears throat> We won indeed. Look at that damage. Oops. And this Iron Giant is a real champ because they went through with the rematch. I thought they would end it. I really did. I really did think, think they would end it. I actually do main Wonder Woman, but Steven is kind of like a weird Wonder Woman, and I'm down with that. Like, seriously. They're like literally the recommended and the expert category. Damn near the same character. No bullshit. And I have a new build with Steven. Oh wait, no, I don't have the perk on. Okay. I didn't even look at it. I was not looking at the perk system the entire time. I do not have the perk on. I thought I did. But with that perk on, with this with the shield bounce perk on. Oh. Hello, hello, hello. There was a little bit of an audio issue, so we ended up starting off right here, right at the beginning of the best of three here. Instead of going in with a side special, I go in with an up clap into a side special. Which is kind of un unorthodox in my opinion, but hey, we're going in. I get caught with a command grab into a side special. I try to charge an up smash to challenge what I presume would be some sort of down movement, but it was a butt clap and it was extremely delayed. I, start, I fire off a side special, up clap, up clap, gets me with a soda charge. Nope, still protects me. Oh shit, butt smash. Beyblade let it rip, side special. I use the bounce off, shield it to up special because of that big ass hitbox. I got the triple jump on. I'm getting a jump every time I touch him, oh shit. Okay, I really need to learn how to combo off of that. Because I'm just kind of autopiloting there. I'm doing a surf shield into up air when I'm nowhere near him. Kind of standing on my shield there, just letting him do his thing. Oh shit. I did not know, I mean like, uh, that's crazy that the shields can, can in fact platform. Which is fucking crazy. And that's me just mashing some shit because I did not have any more jumps, I'm pretty sure. And that's just disrespectful. Oh my god. Oh my dear lord. We're not, we're not even gonna talk about that. We're not gonna talk about that. Iron Giant. Iron Giant. We're not gonna talk about. We're not gonna talk about that. Okay. So we're back into it. Spike. Up special. Belly button. Let's get it. 
Hold on, shield. I'm covering you. You can't fucking move. And look at you. Oh shit. You almost landed on the shield, which was crazy. That does happen sometimes when the shield is just plain and simple, a physical obstacle, and Iron Giant's just sitting there, and I get a free up clap. Ugh. Side special. Stopping the Iron Giant in his tracks, but I get hit with the Beyblade anyway because of his because of its extreme range. He can't even duck under it and move, which is crazy. I don't know what I hit him with there. Oh shit. I'm at 142. This is intense. He's only at 89%. He only has to sneeze on me to kill me as Iron Giant, I'm pretty sure. Okay, I got command grabs. He's, I'm not dead yet. I'm pretty sure he doesn't know the optimal kill. Oh shit, I challenged up the wrong time and he killed me. Uh, he's at 107 though. I don't have to try that hard to kill him. If I can just get one good sequence. Oh uh, no, no protect friends mode? No protect friends mode yet. I thought he would have been had it by now. I guess he doesn't care about it or doesn't know about it. See right there, I'm guessing the up shield. Oh, that was a beautiful up shield into up clap. Yep, I keep dropping quarters on the floor. That's fucking crazy. But anyway, with that being said, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, share my videos around so we can all grow as a channel, and I'll see you all in the next one. If you really like these post-commentary videos, please let me know down in the comment section down below. Peace to the world, and to the world, peace. Blackout.